Through a focus on medical device innovation and patient safety, DR Burton Healthcare is proud to introduce the J1, a semi-rigid intubating stylet that can be used across all subspecialties for safe and effective placement of endotracheal tubes during the intubating process. The J1 is an intubating stylet that helps give support within an endotracheal tube during the intubating process. It can be used with traditional or video laryngoscopy equipment. The J1 is a sterilely packaged, non-latex item. It is a single-use device that is disposable. Let's get started on how to use the J1. Once the J wand is removed from its package, apply a thin coat of water-based lubricant to the stylet. Under no circumstances should a petroleum-based lubricant be used. At this point we can also examine the features of the J wand. The flexible introducer tip which facilitates placement into the trachea during intubation. An ergonomically designed handle with thumb release that allows easy insertion and removal from the endotracheal tube and a supplemental oxygenation port which allows practitioners to perform apneic oxygenation techniques during the intubating process. At this point, after lubrication, the J1 is inserted into the endotracheal tube with care to seal the handle over the distal connector of the endotracheal tube. At this point, the stylet is in place and ready for intubation. Current video laryngoscopy technology allows practitioners outstanding views of the glottic opening through its indirect camera design. Limitations with current semi-rigid stylets do not allow the practitioners to easily maneuver the tip of the endotracheal tube anteriorly and into the glottic opening for endotracheal tube placement. Oftentimes creating an environment where the endotracheal tube becomes hung up below the level of the vocal cords in the piriform recess as seen here. The J wand employs a flexible angled introducer tip that more closely mimics current video laryngoscopy blade design. During the intubating process, the flexible introducer tip bypasses the piriform recess, more naturally moves towards the glottic opening and allows the practitioner to easily and safely place the endotracheal tube, as seen here. During this mannequin demonstration, we can see how a single practitioner can easily and safely place an endotracheal tube using the J1. Currently available stylets are extremely difficult to remove from the endotracheal tube. Notice how easily the J1 pops from the distal connector using the thumb release. The J1 also offers a supplemental oxygenation port which now gives practitioners the ability to perform apneic oxygenation techniques during the intubating process. This video clearly shows oxygen flow from the distal end of the endotracheal tube and directly into the glottic opening, providing an excellent conduit for apneic oxygenation during intubation.